Okay, so it's actually like 9 in the morning and I gotta head off to work. And usually I get all kinds of stuff prepared. But um, day five, we're at day five and the brain is definitely not functioning well. I'm taking the car to work today just because of that. Because I don't necessarily feel that me driving right now on a motorcycle is the best thing in the world. So that's what's happening. I've already been talking to Mary a little bit this morning. She's not feeling great either. So this detox right now is taking a little bit of a beating on us, just so you know. But we're halfway through. This video is going to be short. We're both working late again tonight. And uh, I will see you later on this evening. Are we ready? Sure. Sure. Yep. <laughs> Five days in and it sucks. Yeah, it's a really <clears throat> crappy day today. Yeah. I felt so, like I was hit by a truck. I'm so tired. Yeah. And I thought I was going to fall asleep at lunch during yeah. my break. I was just like so exhausted. Yeah. Yeah. And I was craving every single food I, that I can't eat today. It was really, really tough to yeah. not cheat and get something. That's good. But I didn't. So you say. I didn't. Well, we don't know. <laughs> I didn't. Mm. Mm. You know. Hey. I trust you. Really? Mm. Yeah. I do. I do. <laughs> I do. Thanks. I didn't see any things come out of the credit card, so. Right. Yeah. I wouldn't use the credit card. <laughs> <laughs> Pay cash for that, uh, for sure. not my first rodeo. No. And it's really hot and muggy here. And at my work, I know it's it's hot and muggy, and it's hot and muggy outside, so all of this together is just zapping me. So, uh, not going to do weight today. I didn't lose. I lost. But not a lot, maybe like 0.2 pounds, maybe somewhere Same in that range. With me. Same with you. So I'm not gonna. We're not gonna put that one up there. Um, first five days we did every day. Uh, I don't know if we'll do one for every day for the next five. If we see something that's a big change or the headaches, I still had a bit of a headache today. Yeah, me too. Yeah. So if I see that kind of go away, then we'll fire one of these up. If not then we will definitely throw one up at the end when we're done this whole thing because it's important for you guys to know what the results were and if we thought it was kind of worth doing the initial detox part. There's supposedly this great feeling of I feel better than I've ever felt before and I have energy and I sleep well and all this so I'm really hoping that happens soon. <laughs> yeah. But we kind of did it before. Yeah. We kind of got rid of wheats and grains, and I, I have to admit that was the best I've felt in years. For sure. Right? So it's just getting over the hump and getting through this withdrawal phase, I think, is big. Fun. No. But. So. I want eggs Benedict. You want eggs Benedict. <laughs> but I got to work at Popeye's chicken today, and that's what I wanted. I wanted that. But I didn't have that. I had leftovers. Okay. Which were good. Which were good. Yeah, it's good. And I'm craving Coke pop like crazy today because it's hot. And a cold Coke would be nice. And a beer. I don't. That's for you. I like a beer. Yeah. Okay, we could ramble on about this forever. <laughs> about all the food we'd like to eat. But we're not gonna. And we're gonna. After, even after this 10 days, our hope is that we will continue to eat. Maybe not as finite or as precise as the detox schedule is but we will still stay on track with not eating grains yes. and stuff like that mm -hmm. so and watching our sugars and watching our so that's our goal so you may see us in a couple of days you may see us in the most will be five days from now all right we're gonna go later